Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 9 of Let's Play Castle in the Darkness, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, I'm going to change my mind for now on taking on the Sorcerer, because, well, I figure I might as well take care of a couple things before I take him on. That includes going back to the House of Ruth. But first, why don't we go back to the castle entrance and go look for that, um, you know... That dark room? So I think if we defeat that dark room, we can find another area. The one that we needed a torch for. That was a scary jump, not gonna lie. I think the dark room is over this way. Yeah, because now we have the torch. Oh god. I might have to switch armors for this one. I'm almost at 100 deaths. I will have to switch armors. Or maybe the plural is armor. I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah, armors does not sound right, though. And I here I am, a freaking grammar Nazi. You know, that, that get more hate than real Nazis. Although that seems to have been changing lately. <laughs> not gonna get into that. this lead to? I hope this, this leads somewhere good. Especially because it's so damn dark. Well, it is Castle in the Darkness, after all, not Castle in the Lightness. Although that's what I prefer right now, because God... That's gonna be hard on the eyes. Torture Chambers? I've heard of a place where you might need the falcon magic for some reason. Why? I don't know. But I'm gonna get rid of my X-Sword for now. You can take care of this uh, meat monster, can you? Yeah, I knew what was gonna happen. God, saw blades. I hope they do not instant kill. Cause that would suck. That would be a bloody bad time, no pun intended. Yeah, I think we're doing pretty well here. Okay. Good to know it's possible. Hmm. There's a switch down there for some reason. Why did I get walled in? Actually, I think what I need to do is head back. Okay, those spikes were real. You unlocked E3 Demo! Okay. That's what you get for being so bad at video games. Okay, those spikes are real too. Okay, what was the real purpose of that switch then? Oh, okay, I guess if you hit the switch, that jump down the bottom it gets a little bit harder. But really, if I have the wing boots, the rest of this area is just cake. Oh, you needed the falcon. Oh, I thought that would crumble. You needed the falcon to hit that lever. That's what I needed him for. Okay. Makes perfect sense now. It's actually a really good use. I mean, think about it. Look at the platform. It's got cracks in it. Oh, 
That looks terrifying. Okay, that stops it completely in case I want to go back. Uh, okay, that's possible to get. I don't trust that platform with blood on it. Okay, so far so good. I forgot to test out those grinders to see if they insta-kill. Okay, this looks like some kind of bone dragon. And I gotta hit it right in the tail. It kind of looks like a Moldor, but it doesn't exactly completely move like one. This one's just making straight lines. Okay, I think he's moving faster. Uh oh. Don't die here. Oh, good. <coughs> Hope I didn't make anybody deaf with that sneeze. <laughs> the Falcon doesn't even move when I jump. Alright, you did your job. At least I think you did your job, and that you don't have to do any more. Just in case. The saw blades kill you instantly, now we know! And knowledge is half the battle, and at this point, half of me, because that's what, that's just got me. The underside of spikes can kill you? You can get killed by being under, like, not the pointy end of spikes, but on the opposite end of the spikes. That is just honey bunches of effed up. Oh god. I don't think I can kill that. That's me. Okay. Jeez. I thought I wasn't gonna make that jump. Alright, well, this one doesn't seem too bad. Ugh. Okay, I take that back. That could have been bad. I don't need this platform. I can just do that. I have a feeling this side area was not really meant for the wing boots. But what else was I supposed to do? Odds are I'm going to get the wing boots before I uh, get the torch. That's why I'm going there. Uh, that is frightening. Okay. That's all I did it for? The last page? Well... I don't know how many pages I have now. <sighs> Why do they have to make that so small? Like, seriously? What do they think was gonna happen? Should they be at all surprised that... That could be an easy place to get killed? Okay, the timing of those grinders is a little bit different. That makes me kind of worried for when I have to go back. Okay, let's get that page again, and hopefully we can make it back to the save point with the page.
At least I made the jump. It's just that the big saw blades kill you too. Even though they don't look as sharp. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow, of all the places I could land on. Of course. <laughs> Yeah, I kind of wish there was an item that would give you protection from spikes once. You know, like once per life. That would make this game a hell of a lot better. Like, not as cheap. I would have been okay with that falling spike if it didn't kill you as well. Is a torture chamber. Okay, I can nail this. I can nail this. I believe. Oh man, this thing's been so fast too. Expectations of platforming gamers, I can tell ya. They pretty much have to go to the well for this type of game. I mean, it's not a mandatory area, so... I can expect it to be hard for that reason. I should put that on my uh, Tinder profile. Like, I'm not mandatory, but that's why I'm hard for a reason. Oh, God. That sounds awful! Then again, there's much worse. Some people have no shame. Uh, oh, God. That part frightened the shit out of me for good reason. Okay, just remember, there's a spike that falls down here. There, I don't have to do that part again. But why did my jump get so bad? Weird. I'm guessing that fireball just hurts you and not outright kills you. Does it only shoot once? Nope! Okay, it's not an instant kill. Ugh, God. I think we'll be able to nail this part now. Like this part here. Whoa, okay. No double jump for me. Fair enough. Oh good, another save point. What is this? It's just a ma water flesh. Okay, so that platform with spikes protruding is a non-issue, because I can just fire the laser. Huh. Well, that's a reference to Legion from the Castlevania games. Although he's called Grand Falloon in, I think, Symphony of the Night. I think something else was a Legion in that. I don't know. Oh, there's more. I thought we were done with the torture chamber. Oh, actually we are. Cabin key? The key to the cabin was all the way over here? What a weird place to put a key to a freaking cabin in a torture chamber. That makes no sense whatsoever. I don't care what anyone says. Why here of all places? That 
jump scary for obvious reasons. But at least now we can just go back to the cabin. In fact, I think this is the perfect time to consider going back to the forest. You know, because the mansion, or Root's house rather, and the cabin are both in the forest. So it makes sense to go this way. So that was a bit of a... Oh, God. Good thing my reaction time is... Half decent. I wouldn't say fully decent, because it's not. ASMR channel of just me gaming while whispering, and I'm just gonna yell out shit randomly. Give everybody, like, bad hearing for the rest of their lives. Oh, I thought I could, uh... I'll get hit by the flames twice in a row. Good for me. Dying, boy. Seriously, I hope Meat Boy does not die. I still need to let's play Super Meat Boy one of these days. But it is not this day. As Harry Potter would say in Star Wars. There, actually save would be a good idea. That jump looks very hard to do. You have to be nearly pixel perfect. Really? How did I nail it the first time? I did the same thing as before. Oh, now it works. Oh wow, that flame went all the way from the previous screen. That's commitment. Spike. Okay, now I gotta make it back through the dark. Oh, it flashed light for a moment and then it just went dark again. Funny. Okay, we made it. And luckily, the save point was just across all this. I bet my sword has a lot of range. Girl! We can just go to the forest now. Feel good about that. Not about getting hit, but at least it didn't hurt. Oh, man. Yeah, I think it would be better to... Actually, if I go through the Cave of Serpents and just go left... I think I would be able to get through the forest a little bit sooner? Yeah, I think that'd be a little bit faster. All right, have it your way, Bob. Man, there's like a lot of games I still need to let's play on my channel. Now that I pretty much don't have to worry about any Christmas special games I haven't done yet. Hopefully I can finish Legend of Dragoon before like say, November. Because then I have to do my uh, casting or nominations for the 2017 Christmas special. That is why some of my videos are long. To avoid that being an issue. Okay, well, that's about to spawn a root, but alright. My 
Well, for being impatient, I guess. Oh. Forgot about that. Alright. I think the cabin is not far from here. Oh. Okay. Well, time for me to switch weapons. Fair enough. We'll do that. Go with the executioner. Technically, I still have a sword. Hmm. That's not a bad looking combination. Open this up too, I guess. There's a ghost. Hi. Oh, wow! You just took a whole bunch of my health. And you're back again. Okay, I guess the current spells I have are not good against it. Dark armor? Maybe I should just open up the floor left and then come back with a spell that can actually hurt this boss or hurt this enemy because I'm worried I'm going to die here. No, I didn't die. Although I'm pretty damn close. Don't antagonize the enemies if you don't have to, Bonga, please. Thank you. All right, dark armor. What does it do? Gives me defense of six. Two thousand year old cursed suit of armor. Cursed in what way? Because I don't think it's really gonna hurt me that much. At least I hope not. Can you imagine if it just randomly decides to kill you? Like, well, I told you I was cursed. You didn't listen. Now you pay the price. Just instant death. Like, thanks, Geritol. Okay, so if I want to get to the mansion, I just go this way. I'm pretty sure this spell does not count as a weapon. Otherwise, or counts a spell. Otherwise, I would have used it against that uh, spirit in the House of Ruth. But I don't think it'll work. Okay, if I remember correctly, I have to go this way so I can loop around. No, wait, that's not, that's not true. I'm supposed to go down to the left right now. I think. Yeah, th this seems about right. I got found one boss, and I just made it over here. Then I have to go through the other end of this cave to find the way to the house. That house has so many Castlevania 2 vibes. Just by the exterior, and just some of these blocks. I don't think I really need the extra sword that badly. Energy Splash helped me before, and I think it's going to help me again. Saz, I don't think I used this weapon before against uh, the boss, or even in this dungeon in general. So yeah, I think I'll I'll fare a lot better. Wow. Okay, well, I guess I'm still an idiot sometimes. Yeah, I was waiting for you. Get 
my magic ready. Yep, dark armor is a hell of a lot better to have here. Oh, that is cheap! Did you can you believe that bullshit? She just kept hugging me until she killed me. What was I supposed to do about that? Oh, wait a minute. I can actually keep this spell. Because I forgot about the charge attack. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Yeah, let's just stick with that from now on. I can take care of this ghost, too. There, problem solved. Can't go forgetting about, like, all my assets here. So I better make good use of this, uh, energy blast. It's really the spikes that kill me. Oh, okay. Careful now. There, I got a little bit of separation here. Much better! And make the spikes go away. Okay. Feel a lot better now. Roots key. What is it open? Did I see a locked door when I was here? I'm gonna take my time because I'm worried. For obvious reasons. <laughs> yeah, I don't trust you. Or you. Or you. Or myself at this point. Oh god. Should not have taken that route. Save immediately. Holy crap. That boss was a saga. I don't care what anyone says. It took that long. Did I just get everything over here? Oh yeah, that was where the secret door was. Let's not worry about that yet. this. Dreamstone for 20,000. Oh, okay. I can probably get it cheaper in Chrono Trigger, but whatever. Okay, if I remember correctly, when I tried combinations, it was... Yeah, that. Pretty sure this is gonna be pretty hard. How am I supposed to clear this? Oh, okay. That spider didn't really help me. Should it be the falcon magic? For some reason, I'm thinking maybe the Falcon magic could have some solution to all this. Like, I remember I need to buy the Dreamstone again. And at least I can afford it again. It is annoying having to do that every time. I think I should do that first. I think the Dreamstone might have some use somewhere. Wish there was 
there's some way I can be immune to spikes in some way. The fact that there is no such thing discourages me a great deal. Right, anyway. Oh, I have to reopen it every time. That's annoying, but okay. I just don't have to buy the Dreamstone again. Like, why is there a spider even here? Well, the falcon killed a spider. Can you actually make that jump? Oh, you can make that jump the whole time! Get out of here, you. And you. Oh, I got the heart. Nice. I gotta go back, don't I? Um, we have a problem. I don't know if I can make this jump twice. save point, for Christ's sake. Hmm. Why do I feel like there would be something else here? I just find it very odd that this was all we found. But, that's all we found! I refuse to believe that, though. Where have I not checked out in a while? Am I going this way? Wait a minute, did I even go here? I don't remember going here. That's convenient. Oh, well, free money. Okay, there's a hand pointing down that way. Oh my god. There was really another save point I could have taken. Why is a hand pointing down that way? Ah, it was a fake. Oh. Did I end up back at the beginning? Hold on. I did not save. So let me just die. Then, respawn right there. No, no, no. Let me go down this way. Let's try to get that chest. Explosion! I have no way out, so might as well do that. Uh seems pretty cool, I guess. Let's check out the rest of the mansion. So I still have yet to do that. That enemy just gives you a shit ton of money, I like that. Maybe I have been here at some point, but I don't remember. All I remember is I couldn't go far, because obviously I didn't have the key. Or maybe I died on the way here. Am 
Might as well activate this. It was a trap! <laughs> that is evil game. Unless... What if I hit the switch while I drop? There we go. That did nothing for me, but hey, I'll take what I can get. This is gonna be dangerous if I drop, don't I? Oh god. I can walk past the hand if I... If I hit it, which is good. But man, that... That ghost was annoying. Six doors. Let's try this one. What can go wrong? It was wrong. Number two leads here. Well, I mean, it's not the same way. So I'll take that. Maybe this corpse has a message. Merman may drop an item. Oh, I already have that item. So that info did not fulfill me in any way. Wonder where this path leads. Uh oh. There are numerous doors. So, wanna get lost? Cause this is how you get lost. Oh no. Oh, wait a minute. That's probably the combination that would have opened that door I just visited. Huh, all right. I'll grab my money. And then I'll go this way. I am Ruth, the famous witch. Why the hell are you in my home? I'll steal your soul and make you my slave. <laughs> well, good thing my explosion music... Explosion music... Explosion magic got some early work. Um... Definitely not difficult. She just keeps flying. Oh, God. She has new attacks now. But they don't really hurt that much now that I have the dark armor. You also gotta deal with the, that Cheeto ripoff, too. There, give me all your money. She escaped? Oh, there she is. You have a white orb. It has the power to remove evil energy from someone's heart. But it needs to be activated. This will take a few moments. Oh, that's what I needed the white orb for. You can hold on to it for now. I have a feeling you might need it. Okay, so she just gave me, like, an ability to make that stronger. That is awesome! Thank you! Oh, I didn't get all my health back. Okay, I think it's time for us to leave. What happens if I go down here? Oh, that. Oh, I see treasure. Obvious trap is obvious. Damn it, Master Hand, I don't want to play Smash Bros. yet. And again, there is a reason why I lost the last tournament I was in. Being out of practice. Blood Armor. 
Is it better than what I have now? Actually, I think I had to be grabbed. Let's see. Blood armor. Blood armor. A suit of armor from the city of East absorbs blood. Ugh. This is better. Wait a minute. I have Dreamstone. What if for some reason... There was an inn? But sadly, I have to go all the way through the end of the forest to get to said inn. Which sucks. But I can't jump high enough. So... Why don't we go to the inn and use the Dreamstone? Like, I found it weird that there was an inn in the game. Despite the fact you can heal for free. Very frequently, by the way. So why have an inn? Maybe it's not really for sleeping right away. But rather for something else. So once I figure out what it's for, then I'll end the episode. At least I have all the HP I need. I don't know if I have every spell. I guess that's one way for me to find out, right? Let's see. Let's go with weapons. I don't have every weapon. I'm missing two. I'm missing a piece of armor. Yeah, I'm missing a spell. I might be missing two spells. And then everything else? I guess for the most part, it might be fine. I don't know. I never promise a 100% guide to this game, even though it is kind of possible. It just seems pretty hard to do because of so much stuff. Alright, so this is probably going to be a lengthy episode also. But, at the end of the day, at least progress will be made. A lot of progress towards, like, being prepared for that final boss. Getting my white orb attuned, I did not think I was going to do that either. Perhaps there's, like, more than one ending, and getting the uh, white orb uh, helps towards getting a good one. It's something to do with, like, removing evil from one's heart. So that could be a dead giveaway right there. And there's other stuff I can try out in this game, too. It says I'm about an easy mode. So let's head back to Alexandria. And hopefully I can end this episode soon. I'm still curious about that other statue that has a cracked gem for some reason. Was this the end? I don't remember. No, you're not the... You are not the end. Yeah, one guy is an end. Like, he can be a whole establishment. Keep going in that house. I don't know why. I never learn, I guess. So I'm painting some hidden secrets. Yeah, I've already took care of that. Man, that bomb enemy is so forgettable. You only see him once! And then just doesn't exist anymore. Like, I know that was a nod to Final Fantasy, but you think you just see more than one. I mean, how many zombies have I seen? Zombies are a nod to almost every game. Why'd I jump right to that bone like an idiot? It was this way, right? I'm pretty sure it was past this. Like, really early in the game. 
Yeah, it's right here. Alright, let's go to sleep. Why am I wearing different armor? What? Why am I just... Z's? I'm throwing my sword up in the air. That is a strange world now. I guess if I just fire my uh, all my Z's, I wake up. So let's not wake up. Oh, I run out of time when I do this. Um... Don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, I'm probably going to wake up now. Oh, and I have to spend like 10 gems every time, too, or 10 gold. Alright, let's try this again. There has to be some reason I'm doing all this. Oh, okay, so I have to do that. Am I supposed to touch the princess? No? Okay. Maybe there's like a series of events I got to accomplish. Or did I already accomplish it just by opening that box? So I didn't open that. Maybe I gotta open these boxes in a certain order. Okay, there is an order. Okay, so I gotta open the first one, and then the third one. Okay. So try not to throw your sword as much, because I think that wakes you up faster. Drooling on the mattress. Okay, so get this one. Do I have to get the one in the house? Or is it this one? Okay, let's try for this one. Nope, that didn't open it. So I think it's the one you gotta jump for. Perfect. Can I get it from above? No. Now I think I have to go to the fountain. They're all gonna, they're gonna go together and oh shit! Just gotta fight this giant demon. I guess my dream meter is my health. Okay, that was dumb. Okay, I'm doing better against this boss. But I'm still gonna get beat. Like, that flame was there the whole time! What are you supposed to do? Oh, I ran out of time anyway. Oh, this is a challenge! Alright, you know what? This video is going too long, so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to save, and we're going to stop here. So, in the next part, we'll uh, take on the rest of this. Goodbye, everyone.